<laughs> Hi. Hi <friends>. <laughs> We've got something so exciting today. I've picked nine fragrances from the collection. Justin has no idea what they are. They are all tied together by one common note. Mm -hmm. It should be more prominent in the fragrance, at least to my nose, but I also did try to make it a little challenging for him. So he gets a point for guessing each fragrance. I, mean, I don't really think that there's points, but he gets a gold Tough star <laughs> for guessing each fragrance. And also, do you want to rate them? If you your... want my ratings, I will give you my rating. Okay. So if you want to rate them each, you can, or you can just pick your top at the end. But I will wait until the end to reveal them all. So if you think you know what it is, you'll just save it. And then you can tell me before I reveal it. Okay, wow. It's always a real test, smelling blindly. It's familiar, but it's not. That's wild. That's so weird. Also, they've been drying down for about 15 minutes. Yeah, honestly, I'm not exactly certain what I'm smelling. So there's a warm spiciness to it. I see the color red when I smell this. There's a little bit of this sweetness. I mean, yeah, with the first one, I, I'm just trying to get my point of reference. So I'll need a couple more to see what direction find. we're kind of going in. But yeah. yeah, I mean, I like it. I would rate it as like an eight out of 10. Okay. Whatever great. it is, I do like it. Like it. Number two. Thank you. Mm, okay. I believe I know what this one is. I like it a lot. It's definitely spicy. Definitely spicy. This is a this is a 10. This is good stuff. And you think you know what it is? Yes. We will test him on that before the reveal. Okay, right. number three. <laughs> it's so different being on the other side. We don't do this that often. No, we I know, should it's do really it more. Fun. I love it. I love being in the driver's seat. <laughs> Oh, okay. On paper, this is interesting. Once again, spicy. I think I know what direction we're going in. It's it's a cooling spice, so there's a freshness to it. I actually, I'm not... Oh, I think I know what this is. It could be two things in my head, but I do like it. I feel like it's something I have smelled on you before. I give it a seven and a half. Hey. But yeah, it's spicy. So I think we're doing something spicy. That first one is still evading me, though. Here we go. <sighs> okay. I definitely know what this is. <laughs> <laughs> um, so amazing. <laughs> yeah, this one is its a, a classic. If the roles were reversed, this would not be what's happening. <laughs> yeah, this is a classic. I wouldn't say it's my absolute favorite from the brand among my favorites, but it's one I have to say is great. I would also give this a seven and a half out of 10. Spicy, woody, mostly what I'm getting, at least on paper. But again, I think I know what Did it is. Did you say seven and a half? Seven and a half. Okay, number five. <laughs> and it really wears out the nose. Yeah, right? it really does. I'm always just over here like, oh yeah, let's smell the next one. And you're like, I can't. Oh, okay, okay. It's funny. I feel like I know what this is. The note that I had in mind as the through line up to this point, I don't recall it being super prominent in this, but either I'm wrong about what I think it is, or I just wasn't completely up to date on the note breakdown. Maybe I didn't take a close look or it's been a while since I've seen it. Nonetheless, I like it. It definitely smells more designer to me. I would give it a seven, at least on paper. I'm gonna double check my work on that one. Okay, okay here we go. I mean, you you could be totally right because you did the research and I'm just coming in blind. Mmm, this is nice. Mmm, once again, not completely certain what this is. It is familiar. Wow. It actually kind of reminds me of the first one. Let me smell it again. Now oh, I can see that they are different. And that first one is ringing some bell only halfway. This is warm, sweet, and spicy. Maybe a more balsamic nature to it, more resinous. Ah. <sighs> maybe even like some kind of leather or wood, but I am getting spices. It's not really tickling me quite as much though. Mmm, mmm, eight. Okay. Wow, I don't know what that is. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, this is, I, palette. I know what this is. Such a unique blend of notes and it just works. But yeah, I'm getting something definitely fresh spicy, definitely a little tiny bit powdery, but more rooty. If anything, it's more of like a starchy kind of rooty powderiness that is a little floral, kind of vanilla in a way. Just, yeah, beautiful stuff. This is a nine, good stuff. Okay, I did pick a lot of ones I like. As you should. Picking the ones that you're familiar with is always the best way to go. Hmm. Okay, I think I know what this is. I haven't worn this in a while, but I know this is a favorite for both of us. Spicy, resinous, at least to me, I get an almost resinous feel, like a myrrh or something. Maybe a little bit leathery. <sighs> this is good. Nine. If it is what I think it is, it's been a favorite for a while. Okay. And the last. This is the last one. <laughs> All right. Okay. 
Yeah, I was like, wait, what is that? It's registering. Another classic, fresh spicy, some lavender in there. Sweet, almost like cakey sweet in a way. But cooling spice has that, you know, alluring factor to it. Let's say a nine and a half. Wow. Okay. Just for the sake of memories, I have memories with that one because I've had it for a while. Any guesses on the note and you were right, we have a little misadventure in there. <laughs> Okay, that's fine. That's fine. It makes these videos even more interesting. <laughs> a curveball, yes. shall we say? So would you throw him off the trail? <laughs> shall you, we say? Would you rather me guess the note first, or should we go through the fragrances first? What, what do you think? I think you should guess the note. I think it's cardamom. You're right. <laughs> All right. He's so good at this game. Well, cardamom happens to be one of my absolute favorite notes. So a lot of the fragrances I talk about on my channel, cardamom based, especially when it's like fall, winter time. That's what you're mainly gonna see. A lot of you guys call me out for it all the time. Oh, it looks like you like cardamom. You're always talking about cardamom. I'm like, yes, because it's freaking good. I also love cardamom. Yes, it's fantastic. Quickly, I want to see if I can guess these fragrances. Yes, totally. So the first one. I'm going to reveal them as you guess. Okay, first one. It's close, but I cannot place it. You're gonna I'm going to so be so mad. mad. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Gosh. It's not fair because it's on the screen, so you already know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I'm going to be mad. I, I can't place it. Okay. What is it? Oh, dang it. Guerlain, okay. So now it makes sense. Lomidial Intense. Good you can stuff. Talk about it if you want. I mean, I talk about it a lot. It's it's spicy, kind of smoky, sweet. Good stuff for the cold weather. Okay. Do you have a guess for two? Two is Labyrinth of Spices. Ding 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 ding. Yes. Winning. Unmistakable. <laughs> Unmistakable. So impressive. I mean, I've been nerding out about. We both have been it's nerding so about I, this I really for a while. To include it. I love it so much. Okay. Third one. Yes. Is this intoxicated? It is. Okay. It's so different on paper. It almost yeah, smells like soap, <laughs> like a cleaning product, but on skin. Where's Gabriel when we need it? Yes, seriously. <laughs> By Killian. This is one that I bought for her a couple yeah. years ago, and she's loved it. And I, I wear it every now and then. Good stuff. Coffee, obviously cardamom. People say it smells like a niche version of Mugler Angel Men, also called Amen, which we don't have then. It's okay. All right, next one. This is Oudwood. Yeah. Tom Ford. He's so good at this it, game. <laughs> I just, again, <laughs> cardamom happens to be one of the ones that's closest to me. It's just an affinity. Nothing to really say about this one. It's been talked about so much, but it's one you just, you can't hate. Even if you, you hate it, you can't actually hate it. Okay. Number here's five. the misadventure. Is this one million lucky? Yes. Okay. And cardamom is in one million. It's not oh, in one million lucky. Oh, God. It. Okay, well, you were right. Either way, one million lucky is so good. It's um, great. Honey, hazelnut, plum, sweet, but also has a freshness to it. Just great. Great for a designer. It's so good. While being okay. very mass appealing. Okay, six. See, this one reminds me of like two or three fragrances we have. This is not from Adamo, is it? No. Okay. This is not from Lark, is it? No. Man. God. Yeah, this is evading me. I got several things going off in my head. Let me smell it. I'm so curious what it smells like. Is it obvious to you? Like, well, oh yeah, yeah. It's but clearly it's that. because I know what it is. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure. Okay. Yeah, I gave it an eight. Yeah, what is this? It I like is it so much. Poppy Leafico. Oh, it sure is. <laughs> That's crazy. I'm so excited I stumped you at least You know, twice. the funny thing is, is that there's some of these fragrances that I talk about a lot that I've never actually smelled on paper. As soon as I got them, I put them on skin and I've been talking about them from wearing them on skin. I've never smelled this from paper. But now, it, I mean, it's obvious to me now, but at first it, it reminded me of those other fragrances I just, I was thinking of like an Adamo number two maybe, and then Lark argentium something yeah. like that it kind of has a similar vibe on paper but it's totally different cardamom is a good note in that one it really is okay, okay. seven do you know what it is seven is gris charnel yes is it the x-ray it does no no okay on paper i thought i was getting a lot of sandalwood but either way I mean, the sandalwood is a lot in yeah. this one. Yeah, but and no, I, I know cardamom is heavy in this for sure. Mm -hmm. I just, sandalwood is more prominent in the X-ray than it is in the EDP. So I was getting that, but I think it's fine. It doesn't matter. It's great. Great cardamom, fig, iris, just beautiful. Okay, number eight. This is so fun. African Leather. Yes. By Memo. 
can't go wrong with that one. I don't talk about that one that much these days. I don't know why, but it needs more talk, which means it needs more wear. Yeah. <laughs> it's so great. It is so good and it's very powerful too for those that care. Last one, which again, I think I know, La Nuit de mm -hmm. Yeah, this one, I've had this bottle since 2016. I don't wear it that much anymore, but I've worn it a lot in the past. So, you know, a lot of great memories. This was like the start of my fragrance journey. I really got excited about this one. So yeah, you can't unsmell it ever. That was fun. That was so fun. I can't believe I stumped you twice. Yeah, you and... got two. And it's it's really sad. The two that I, were, I stumped on are ones I talk about often and I love. <laughs> it just goes to show when you're on the other side. Paper it's... is not the full experience. Yeah, it's tricky. So I think, I mean, depending on what you guys want to see, we'd love to know your thoughts on this video. We'd love to do more of these. Like, yes, we're, we... we're definitely going to break out the box. This was the first time. Yeah. So I already have lots of ideas for more obscure, hopefully being able to show you other bits of the collection and also see if we can stump just illustrious but, nose. And honestly, we'll have to make it go the other way because Grace has a nose that has developed leaps and bounds. It was already great to start <laughs> off with. And I know people would want to see this go the other way. So we'll have to do it. So, I mean, sure. this is an endless series. If you guys want to keep seeing this, we'll have to hold ourselves back to not do this again. So please <laughs> want to see it, please. Anyway, thank you guys so much for tuning in. We really appreciate it. Let us know what you think of these fragrances in the comments. Check them out if you haven't decan yes. it. get your decans don't blind buy full bottles <laughs> <laughs> if you can avoid it there will be links in the description as I usual mean, if you want, it's fine. thank you to grace for hosting such a fantastic she put all of this together so awesome job thank you so much for tuning in peace see you in the next one